And tonight at 12 News Exclusive, for the first time, we're hearing from a teenage girl from Orange who was the victim of a violent attack earlier this week. The video of that crime went viral. The video is there on your screen. Now her accused attacker, Christopher Sini, faces a misdemeanor assault charge. Good evening and thank you for joining us today. 17 year old girl Kalia Taylor decided that she wanted to speak up. She says this was the result of road rage. 12 News reporter Gloria Walker spoke with Kalia and her mother exclusively to get their story. Gloria. Well, Leticia, fear and shock. Those are just some of the emotions that 17 year old Kalia Taylor felt on Monday. She was attacked on the side of the road. We all saw that video and it was quite shocking. Monday evening, things changed dramatically for the teen. We spoke to Kalia and her mother at her side. Let's get to what exactly started this. Kalia says she was watching the sunset on Bailey's Road in Bridge City. She drove around Christopher Sini's truck because it stopped in the road. She stopped about a mile down the street to enjoy the scenery with her friend. A minute later, she says Sini pulled up and confronted her. And pushed me on my car and then all of that happened. And then I just remember getting up after he threw me on the ground the last time, taking a picture of his license, and I was like, that was just crazy, pathetic, <laughs> like, just speechless, shaking, just not, lots of emotions. When the, when the video was first put out, um, I, I didn't want it out there just yet, um, because I wasn't home, and I, you know, I was trying to get here. And um, so when it went out, and the overwhelming response. She had just moved home to Orange about a month ago after being in the Dallas area for nine years. Taylor says she's been a competitive cheerleader for the last 12 years, so she actually knew how to properly fall without hurting herself. That was a benefit when she was attacked. And the family hopes that justice will be served. More on their story tonight as it will air on the 10 o'clock news. Live in studio, Glory Walker, 12 News.